Welcome to the Rice County Historical Society. This is going to be our last episode on navigating the Dalby database. We've skipped all kinds of different tricks and tips and databases, but I think that the ideas and suggestions that we've made along the way are enough to help you at least get some initial navigation. Don't hesitate to give us a call if you've got any additional questions. Today what I want to highlight is the obituaries database because it's more than just obituaries. Um, again, we're going to stick with the Whipple name. It certainly does include obituaries. As you can see here, we've got a Lieutenant John, and his obituary was listed in the Faribault Central Republican on February 17, 1869. And the entire obituary is listed, typed in verbatim, which is absolutely incredible information. But not everything in the obituary section, in the obituary database, is actually exclusively obituaries. In, in fact, here's a good example. George Whipple, Reverend George Whipple, it, it's a biography and that came out of the book History of Rice County which was published in 1882 and the t this section is of course on the Reverend George Whipple. This is actually a really good key for me to point out. This material is hand entered in by the Dalbys, and so occasionally you can find some typos. So just be just be aware of that, that that may influence your search. But you can see here that this is a great biography about him. But the obituaries are text heavy and can sometimes be really overwhelming to search. There's a great key or great code if you hit the control button and the F button. A find feature will pop up at the top of your screen and if you type in the word Whipple, the, the whole database will highlight everywhere the word Whipple shows up in the database and so that can be really valuable when again these text heavy um, obituaries show up so maybe again you're looking for a mom and you know her uh, you know her maiden name but you don't know her whip, her married name you can enter in in the obituary section you can enter in um, maiden names under the notes section and that can help reveal more information it, the Dalby database, it's an absolutely incredible database. I encourage you all to look around. Don't hesitate to contact them for if you've got any questions here down in the comments section or give us a call, the Rice County Historical Society. Rice County Historical Society, preserving the past for future generations.